How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. We all love leaks when it comes to Horizon 5. Leaked cars, leaked DLCs, leaked features and stuff like that. However, not all leaks turn out to be true. Some of them we end up forgetting about because they just don't end up in the game. So that's why in this video we're going to be taking a look at past leaks that still aren't in the game. Some of them we should still possibly expect to get in the game at some point. Some of them we should just forget about because it's been that long. We're going to take a look at what's left. If you do enjoy this video, guys, please do subscribe. Helps out massively. Let's take a look at these things then, shall we? I do need to note, guys, that everything talked about in today's video, just because it was leaked in the past does not mean we will ever get it. It's still worth talking about. There is quite a high chance that we will get at least some things shown in this video into the game eventually. Just because we're talking about it doesn't mean we will definitely get it. First leak is a barn find. This barn find was leaked a good couple of months ago now, and as you can see on screen, a new file was found within the files of Horizon 5 after an update, and it was in the sort of the new sign language clips files, and it was a file that's quite clearly labeled Barn Find 1986 Ferrari 288 GTO Evolution. When you see these words together, Barn Find and then a Ferrari, it's very difficult to presume that this would be anything else other than a potential Ferrari GTO Barn Find. We've yet to receive it in the game. We sort of allocated this to be a potential barn find for expansion one, which it turned out not to be. Now we've had the first expansion. Maybe this will be the barn find for expansion two, or maybe even in a later update. We'll have to wait and see. Next up is a community gift event. You may remember back in December, we had the secret Santa. That was where we all worked together as a community to unlock rewards by doing certain challenges over the course of December. Well, there have been other gifts found within the files that hint towards another community gift event. And those two cars are the 1910 Fiat S76 Beast of Turin and the 1967 Hearst Shifters Baja Boot. We mentioned this many, many months ago, and we've still not really found any signs of it yet. This does sort of tie in with the old barn find thing because these also have barn find related sort of textures and you know wording with them so will these be barn finds will this be a community gift event will it be a bit of both we're not sure what we do know is december is approaching it's going to be christmas again maybe these will be the rewards for this christmas's secret santa if we do get another one within horizon 5. The next one is quite an obvious one we're not going to spend much time on this it's all of the cars there are still an ton of cars that have been found within the files that aren't in the game yet we talk about this quite regularly so we're not really going to focus much on it all of the cars in black still haven't come to the game i said at the beginning of the video just because they're on this list doesn't mean we'll ever get them it's just speculation and guessing the next leak are aftermarket companies that modify cars and body kits and manufacturers and all that kind of jazz we know that Tesla and Rolls-Royce are not in the game anymore. They can still be found in the files, but it's quite obvious why they're not in the game. Saab and Spiker are two manufacturers that have also had logos found in the game as well. There's a very good chance that these are all just leftovers from previous Horizon games. That applies to everything in this video, to be honest. But the aftermarket companies that get spotted in the files are quite interesting, and these have been leaked for Horizon 5, such as the five seen on screen right now, amongst many 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 others these are just aftermarket companies that take cars and upgrade them give them really cool body kits now this just brings up potential updates for the future horizon 5 in terms of body kits could we get novatech body kits or novatech cars could we get upgrades that these manufacturers can make there's a world of opportunities another horizon story was leaked a few months ago we've yet to see it it is called javs cab the logo was leaked here as well now this does seem quite similar to a story we've had in the past whether it's a leftover or whether it was changed we don't know but this is just a slight hint at a possible new horizon story we have yet to see as i said the logo is on screen there isn't much information with this one other than that it was titled jabs cab the festival playlist logo leaks was certainly one of my favorite it wasn't that long ago but we've still yet to see them these three logos were found in the files and leaked just a few weeks ago now about a month ago actually now these are the icons shown on the festival playlist coming soon page and we haven't seen them in the game yet we know that the middle one looks kind of like the hot wheels sort of map 
The one on the left of the, on the right, we don't really know. We haven't seen them yet. We already know what we're getting in October. So this probably doesn't apply to October. Maybe they apply to November or December. As much information as we know about this is that the, this one is called Bonus Boards. This one is called Nexus. And this one was called We Will See You Soon. Dot png that one still interests me to this day i hope we find out eventually what this is is it a feature is it just a random red herring as much as we do know these are festival playlist icons that are in the files will we ever see them let's wait till november and december and january and february and every other upcoming update this isn't really a leak as per se but it is worth noting that deleted things are still worth talking about back in march a few things were added to the files and leaked, and these were the Audi RS3, the Ford SVT Lightning, and the 2018 Range Rover SVR, amongst quite a few other cars. And just very randomly, as an update came, these three were deleted from the files. However, a couple months later, they ended up getting added to the game, but not all of them. The Audi RS3 sedan and the Ford SVT Lightning were eventually added, after being deleted from the files, the Range Rover SVR, however, hasn't been added to this day. So if you hear any word about leaks being deleted or files being deleted from Horizon 5, that really doesn't necessarily mean that they are being wiped from existence because these were later added. The Range Rover SVR was still possibly waiting on. DLCs. Now we know about two DLCs that are coming to the game. We know that we're getting a Donut Media DLC and presumably a second expansion at some point. Donut Medium basically told us themselves, I don't know if they were supposed to, but they basically told us themselves that a DLC is coming to the game that's Donut Media related. In a Forza DLC pack, mm -hmm. um, you can drive high car, low car, the money pit cars, uh, high truck, low truck, all of our stuff. We have later now heard that it's going to be a Horizon story in Q4 of this year. We Once again, we already know what updates are coming in October. We don't know the full information about it yet, but we know that the Donut Media DLC is not in October, so we can most definitely expect it in November or December. My best guess is November, since December will probably stay Christmas themed. So November is my guess, best guess for Donut Media. I heard a bit of chatter about this on Twitter and the forums, but this is a sort of a Steam page regarding a DLC that popped up just a couple of weeks ago and it's titled Forza Horizon 5 D DLC. Now every sort of DLC and car pack and add-on for a game has its own little page on Steam. As you can see for Forza Horizon 5 there are quite a lot here including some DLC cars and further down it says VIP Pass. And this one was added 13 days ago. It doesn't really say anything about it, but it is new some kind of Forza Horizon 5 DLC that's been added to the Steam page. It's presumably maybe being worked on. Now, I don't know what they would class as a DLC. This might end up being the Donut Media thing that we were on about. But people are speculating that the D stands for December, December DLC. Are we getting a December DLC for Horizon 5? I think that's a bit of a stretch. It does say it's released a bit further down, but I don't really think that makes much sense. It could be just the wording for the Donut Media DLC or Donut Media add-on. DLC is a very strange word. Technically, it means downloadable content, but lots of people class non-downloadable contents as DLCs. So we don't really know what this is. It could just be nothing or it could be something. But from this video, guys, I hope you see there is actually quite a few things in the game that aren't in the game yet. Quite a few things to hopefully look forward to. Cars, festival plays, images, stories, DLCs, barn finds, events. There's quite a lot in the works. Now, as I said at the beginning, we may not get anything I talked about today, or we might get all of it. There's no way of knowing, but it's still cool to talk about. Let me know in the comment section below what you hope from this video is going to come to the game the most. If you think any of it's wrong, or if you want to add to any of it, feel free to let me know. In general, guys, leave a like if you've enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already for more content just like this. And I'll see you all later.